So usually we start with a kick drum or a snare drum, but this time something different happened. Yeah. Jack dropped his keys, and I said, Jack, do that again, but we'll record it. And so then we pitched it up an octave, and it sounded very uh, weird. And so we started to mess around with it a little bit, until it started to sound like a beat. You hear that? Then we added a kick drum that sounded like this. Then we forgot about it. And a week later, we were listening to this song. And he the vocal, we didn't notice the bass line, no, what we noticed was that snare drum, that really tight snare drum. Uh, play it again. And he lay the fire you hear that? So we went about recreating that snare drum. We started with this. Uh, that needs more reverb. Can you add a little reverb? Uh, that's too much. Dial it back a little bit there. Yeah. Then we added some high end and a little bit of low end. Laid it down with the kick. Oh, bring back in that key speed from before. There it is. So right now it's in 3 4, which is 1 2 3, 1 2 3. But we thought, what if it was in 4 4? 1 2 3 4, 1 2 3 4, like that. Can we do something more major? Yeah, that's better. Friendlier. Then we added a bass line. Courtesy of Adam. Adam. Let's go. Then we added some high notes. Courtesy of Chris. Chris. So you know how he likes to do a lot of this old-timey orchestral sampling on Neo Theater? You know, stuff that sounds like this. Well, we think for this song, what if we sampled our own sample? Uh, that sounds kind of weird, I'm going to show you what I mean. I guess that still sounds kind of weird. How about I play it all together? Cause I wanna move out, I don't wanna move on
Cause I wanna move out, I don't wanna move on Can you keep my leg and shadow? Cause I wanna move out, I don't wanna move on It's cold out there, you stand in there You're trying to face your greatest fear You're shivering, you're trembling It's warm in here, so come back in Cause I wanna move out, I don't wanna move on